Cześć, to jest All Mate Drop Bear. G'day everyone, All Mate Drop Bear here. Now I know what you're thinking, didn't I click on a delicious video? Well, the good news is that you did, and I'm here to let you know that Delicious and I are doing a review together. And what we'll be reviewing is a Polish individual food ration, SR3. So, mate, thank you so much for this opportunity to work with you. I'm truly honored that you thought of me and asked me to do it with you. Jinko ye, delicious. So, let's check this thing out. Looking at the baggage here, very, very thick, good quality, durable plastic. Nothing written on the back at all. And, looking at the front, something which I really like is that this thing actually has the menu and the contents written on the front of it. And it's got it in three languages. Polish, English, and French. You can also see here that it's got the best before date, and it's the 10th of November, 2017. You've also got this barcode. So I don't know whether that means that this MRE is a commercial one, or they just use this barcode to keep track in the warehouse of what's going in and out. So let's check out what's inside. So I'm actually going to slice this one open at the back as I do want to keep this as a memento. So let's have a look at it. So now we've got the contents laid out, let's see what we've got. We've got a big Ziploc bag here, a vitamin C flavoured candy, xylitol gum, coffee flavoured candy, got a pack of a napkin here, a very very thick napkin. I've also got a wet nap here, got a fig flavoured fruit and seed bar, a spoon. This one's actually a pretty good quality here as well. You look at it and you're not expecting too much, but considering what it is, it's pretty good quality. I've also got a drinking straw, a pack of toilet paper, and this stuff looks really rough. Don't know how good that would be. I'm not willing to try it myself. We also have another little napkin here. This came in a little pack with the spoon. We have our raspberry flavored instant tea drink, our flameless ration heater. We've got two packets of special crackers and there's two crackers in each packet. We have black currant jam, our traditional pate, and finally we've got our main, which is a 300 gram pack of Mexican style chicken stew. And it comes in this cardboard sleeve, which is really, really good to just help protect it a little bit more. Worked really, really well. So, I guess it's time I send you over to the main man, Delicious. Over to you, mate. Welcome from Poland. Witam z Polski. To jest zawartość polskiej racji żywnościowej. Menu numer 3 jest to racja jedno, jednoposiłkowa. Mamy potrawkę z kurczaka po meksykańsku, 300 gramów razem z ogrzewaczem bezpłomieniowym, dwie paczki sucharów specjalnych, pasztet tradycyjny, dżem z czarnych poszeczek mój ulubiony, mamy baton o smaku figowym, mamy koncentrat napoju herbacianego o smaku marinowym, łyżkę, serwetkę i akcesoria. Tutaj mamy cukierek z witaminą C, gumę do rzucia, sól, pieprz, cukierek kawowy, chusteczka mokra i mamy papier toaletowy, czy też inne większe chusteczki. So let's prepare this ration. I will put it on a tray and I will prepare this on tray with the flameless Russian heater. First I will start this heater. It's a table type single. So in the previous rations we had this twin, but it was actually too much power. So that now they have they give you only one heating pad. First I remove this Leave. Here on this instructions, 
it is written clearly how to measure the water because I'm not sure in some cases how much water so should you use this fill line without the content and you know to fill the water and then put this uh, but in this case you should first put the entree and then fill the water I will let it stand for 15 minutes. Now let's unpack the rest of these things. Our famous panzer waffles. The Russian has best before date of November 2017, as this crackers has uh, the date of March 2018. We have this pate, which is a pork pate with pork liver. This thick fruit bar. And, um, uh, and the jam. Blackcurrant jam is one of the best in my opinion. Let's open this accessory bag. Maybe we'll need the napkin and this moist toilet. And we have the spoon. Now it's time for this raspberry tea drink. I will give here cold water. This is a Ziploc bag, so it is safe to mix this drink here and then to use this straw. But let's make it in a glass. Thanks heaps mate. Well, I've tried a few of these and already absolutely fantastic start. With the special crackers, hard as a rock as always, but the caraway inside just gives it such a nice fresh hit. And even just the way it's cooked and the taste of it, really nice fresh baked sort of flavour to it. With the pate, I've never tried pate before, so I think I might be lucky with having this as my first go at some. It's got meatiness, creaminess, fattiness, and even some seasoning in there too. So it goes absolutely fantastic, really, really nice flavor. I was actually surprised how good it is. It also goes really well on to these special crackers as well. The flavor and texture hit just really work well together. The black currant jam, really, really nice as well. On its own, you've got the sweetness, the flavor of the fruit, but also with the texture, you have the chunks of the pulpy bits of fruit from when it was getting made, even the seeds and stuff in there. Great, great quality jam. We also tried some on the special crackers as well, and it did really bring out the caraway flavor a lot more when I had it there. So that was quite interesting. And the fig fruit and seed bar was absolutely fantastic as well. I really like this rice paper that's on the outside of it. It really does stop your fingers from getting sticky when you're holding it. And the texture with the seeds inside, a great little crunch to add to it. And finally, some of the other fruit flavors I could tell was apricot and apple. And I did try the raspberry instant tea drink. That was so fresh, so flavorful. Absolutely loved it. It was amazing the sort of freshness that they can fit into that there. It's almost like it had fresh squeezed raspberries put into that. Fantastic. 
And back over to you, mate. I've done a trace already. I put it for 20 minutes because uh, this Flemish Russian heater didn't want to, want to start. But I hope it will be uh, enough. All is wet. It will be better to cut. Put it on a tray. Let's taste all the side dishes. This is pork pate with pork liver. As you can see, it is very soft. I will just try it on its own. Hmm, this is very good. I thought it would be more bitter coming from this uh, pork liver but it is really not it is really meaty so now let's try with this cracker well something what I would like to say to the people who hasn't had the opportunity to taste this Polish special crackers the same are in, in the Lithuanian uh, Russians please don't bite it just like cake or piece of bread because they are too hard and you may lose your teeth so I would rather um, recommend to break it first break a bite-sized piece like this and then to eat it it goes very well together this is crunchy this is soft and tastes good. I will use this napkin. See my spoon. Because now there's black currant jam or jelly. It's very firm. It is really good. It is um, a bit sweet because uh, there is a sugar here, but you can taste this black currant, this sourness, and it's also good together with this cracker. Yeah, that's it. That's also combining this savory cracker with this uh, sweet jam is good. Now this thick bar, also this here is a rice pepper. It, it's edible. If you haven't had this, just just bite it. No worries. I will just bite. It is very tasty. It, it this is the taste of dried fig. Uh, together with some cereals, not too sweet. Very natural taste. Let's have a sip of this cold raspberry tea. It's good. It's refreshing. And uh, not too sweet, not too sour, you can taste the raspberries, no doubt what kind of taste it is. So thanks heaps mate, this main was absolutely fantastic. The nice big chunks of chicken in here, really really well cooked too that chicken. Um, great flavour, great taste. Um, the sauce was not overpowering at all, so... You could still get a nice bit of flavor from the corn and the beans too with it. I ended up actually putting that salt and pepper into it and that seemed to help bring out some of those flavors that were in the sauce. With the vitamin C lolly, that was great. Really nice, you could either just suck on it or soft enough that you could actually chew on it. Just be careful though, it does get stuck in your teeth. The coffee lolly, you know what, anything coffee flavored I like. 
and that was no exception. Really, really enjoyed it. And finally, the xylitol gum. That stuff was great. Really nice, fresh, mint taste, nice and soft. Worked well. Now the entree. I'll try to zoom. Yeah, I hope you can see it. This is a very good entree. You have pieces of chicken which are so big, so something like one and a half inch or five centimeters big. There are a couple of them, actually five, five, six here. You have corn, you have uh, tomato sauce, you have red beans. So it's time to taste. I will taste everything at once. So a bit of chicken. This is really good. This has also some herbs. Um, and uh, this chicken is a real not processed meat. Uh, one thing which I could add here is the salt. Yeah, it's much better. Unfortunately, this Russian heater didn't work very well, so it is lukewarm. It's not hot. I don't know why, because uh, in the previous Russians, Polish Russians, I have never had problems with this uh, uh, Russian heaters. Now at the end, uh, let's clean our my hands. This be fresh lemon scented. Moist toilet. And let's taste this Dicky vitamin C candy. This is hard candy. In my case, this is lemon flavor. Uh, it's just hard candy, but inside you have kind of jelly, which is a uh, very nice addition. This candy is quite sweet, but Together with this lemon taste and uh, a bit of sourness, it's uh, very good. Now this coffee, and this is a candy, of course, but uh, this is this has a coffin inside, and it corresponds to one small cup of coffee. So this is not only just candy. Uh, it is also coffee, so please don't give it to your uh, children if you want to give them some sweets from Russians. I like this, this candy, this coffee, because um, they combine three tastes. One, one, is, one is the coffee flavor, another is the milk and the third is the sugar. It's a perfect combination. And let's finish it with this xylitol mint gum have two briquettes so that's very fresh spearmint taste this uh, this chewing gum is <coughs> fresh so no problems with chewing and this was the review the joint review of this polish Single meal ration menu number three Mexican chicken. It was very good ration. The entree is really something like a food you can make at home. And uh, this this pate uh, particularly I, I like it. Uh, this smooth consistency and the taste. Thank you very much. Dziękuję uh, bardzo. Together with my mate, all my dropper from Australia. Thank you for watching, subscribe our channels and see you in the next reviews. So to everyone watching, thank you so much for stopping by checking it out. Really hope you enjoyed it. I had a blast doing it. And don't forget, leave a thumbs up, leave a comment, let us know what you thought. Also don't forget to hit subscribe on Delicious' channel as well as my own. And Delicious, mate, thank you so much for this opportunity. Really, really enjoyed working with you and looking forward to hopefully maybe doing it again in the future. Jingle ye. Thanks for watching, everyone. See ya.